So Michael and I, when we first started, guys, it was none of this shit. It was banded signs, door knocking, like Sean said, and, um, and driving for dollars. That was the main shit. So we used to, we used to go drive for, knock, door knock, at the same time drive for dollars, and on Saturday nights we go put banded signs. And we got in our head one day, you know what, man? Vance Jackson, that's where all the action's at. We're going to put banded signs all up and down them, every single fucking pole. There's like 150 poles. So we're at this shit all night for like five hours. And I swear, the cops would pull over, and they would see us, and the cops would be like this, look, look, look. they look. They were like, motherfuckers. So check this out. We put the signs up, and we're feeling really good about ourselves, right? And for those of you guys who heard this story, you know it's fucking funny. Now, real quick, real quick. Bandit signs for you guys as newbies, because they know SMS and PPC and Facebook leads. That's the old little sign on the telephone poles. We buy ugly houses. That's what he's talking about. Some so guys... we get it in our head. We're going to do this shit. And we feel really good about ourselves. I was tired, man. You know, I'm, you know I was tired, man. And, and we, had these, we had these poles, right? We, we, we'd stick up the pole. And then, and then we'd hit it with another pole that had the stapler on it. So we had them about 14 feet up, right? And then on Monday, we get a call. And... You, we don't ever answer the calls. Don't answer the calls. You got to listen to the recordings because it might be code compliance trying to trick you, right? You get fined for that shit. And, 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 and we had a call. It's a call and I listen, nugget right there. I listen to it, and I hear this. <sighs> and I already know. I know that fucking sound. I know as a fat guy. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> you motherfuckers. You motherfuckers, I'm gonna get you, motherfuckers. And I was like, dude, that's Coke and Blinds. <laughs> so we rushed down there, right? We're fucking tired, man. We fucking rushed down there, and sure enough, he cut all the fucking signs with some fucking shit. He cut them all in half. We're like, oh, motherfucker, wanna play? There he's there. So we went, and I showed you guys the pose yesterday, right? So we went, and remember, I'm about 5'10, and then the pose, like, we were about 14 feet. We were like, what, what 14, 15 okay, feet? Yeah. So I went and got an extension. We're using PVC pipes. <laughs> about five feet. So we went another 150 signs. And we put those motherfuckers up like 22 feet. You need to, you need to imagine the scenario. It's three in the morning. Yeah. I'm with the pole. Go ahead, Charles. Yeah. <laughs> now, we would do it quick. We had a signs, man. We had the poles. We stick them out. Boom. We get out there, do four. And again, the cops would, would fucking... So, so anyways, man, on Monday, on Monday, we get a call. And again, it's, <sighs> and, I, and this, he sounded a little angry, right? He's like, you motherfuckers. <laughs> and he had that little voice, right? Because I got this, oh, shit, this motherfucker mad. And he started blowing a whistle into the fucking phone. And I know why he did it. He's trying to hurt my ear. He's trying to get me. <laughs> And I thought it was funny. And we went, and he, the sign stayed up there. But then we realized, nobody can see the fucking sign. <laughs> so about five months ago, we had code compliance in here. They, they brought in the strike force. They have a strike force here in San Antonio where they, 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 they just fucking looking for motherfuckers that don't get permits. And the main guys came in here, the captains and everything, and they pulled me to the side. They're like, hey, you know, one of our guys, his name is George, and... Uh, we know it was you guys that put all the signs on Vance Jackson. He still, he don't like you, motherfucker. That's why he ain't here. <laughs> that is a true story. 